Bruce Lee is considered a true legend. He was the undisputed king of martial arts during by thousand fans around the world. His name is synonymous with power, charisma, strength. He was the spokesperson for the three cultural movements which enveloped the martial arts. The athlete of extra speed, Albert Einstein of the martial arts. His incomparable talent propelled him to Hollywood. He left no obstacle in his way. But on July 20th, 1973, he died in tremble circumstances after falling into a comet, the home of his mistress. So where does Bruce Lee come from and who was he? But how was he dead? We will try to answer all the questions in this video, which will be based on the real beginning and end of King Bruce Lee. Real name Lee Jan Fai, say Bruce Lee born in San Francisco in the United States on November 27, 1940. His first name Bruce would have been given to him by a nurse at the Chinese hospital in San Francisco where he was born, while his father, Lee Won Chun, a star of Chinese operas and tower in California. Bruce Lee was recently in Hong Kong near his two brothers Peter and Robert, as well as his two sisters Agnes and Phoebe. Lee Won Chun, Bruce Lee's dad, was an actor and slide to Bruce being introduced to Tai Chi and appearing in several Asian films during his childhood. Bruce Lee was very clever. When he was little, he was called the just he was always on the move. At school, he was the sufferer of this camera. But at 13, he was beaten up in a street fight, then turned to my slide to learn how to defend himself. So he ran the year in 1953 at the age of 15. His father enrolled him in a school of the most famous martial art in China, Master Ip Man, and it was near Hong Kong, Nia, to validate his American national. And because his mother wanted to keep him away from the Chinese three gangs where his son was fighting constantly and regularly, Bruce Lee was sent to the United States at the age of 19 and beginning studying today at the University of Washington. At the same time, he also gave the Kung Fu course at this university. He was there that he met his future wife, Linda, a young student, and married in Oakland, California on August 17, 1964, following which they gave birth as two children, Brandon in 1965 and Shannon in 1969. It was at this time that Bruce Lee began to seriously teach martial art by opening school. He teaches anyone who wants to learn the style of Kung Fu called Jen Fen Kung Fu School based on Wing Chun. And this teaching was fully perceived by Admash La School, who believed that Kung Fu should only be taught to Chinese people. To preserve his school, Bruce Lee said they took up a challenge to fight the master on junk man and if he lost, he would have to close his school. Think down. Bruce Lee won the fight with difficulty, which motivated him to reflect on an effective martial art and give birth to a new combat sport in his mind, Jet Kundo. Although victory in his fight against Master Hong Jung Man, the young master is disappointed by his performance. His daddy was able to knock out an opponent in a few seconds by a fight, required all his energy. 
it is this Miss Vantir that will lead him to question traditional teaching and to take an interest in bodybuilding. Jet Kundo helped to be more practical, more fluid and fast than traditional Kung Fu but above all more adapted to real combat by integrating techniques from English boxing, French boxing, Thai boxing, safe defense, facing so on. He was also taught as a miscall building system. Bruce Lee began to work a lot more, Miss Cole and others. At the same time, he also tried to pursue a field career that began in Chuldon in China. But most of his income comes from teaching. Bruce Lee was determined and capable of doing anything to be at the top of her. So in the beginning of the year 1970, during a weight training exercise, he serious re-injured his back while he started a series of good morning, a particularly demanding exercise for the low back with a lot of around 60 kg. The exercise consists of bending over and gearing up. The doctor consults him and diagnoses a lesion of the fourth second nerve. So he is forbidden to practice martial art as before and will keep him full. She called from this accident all his life. Bruce Lee stay as strong, paralysis for 60 months and abandon all physical exercise and take the opportunity to write down that and sketch you on his vision of the art of combatant on the relationship between this and their wisdom. Bruce has always wanted to go beyond what his body can accept for fear of not being the best or not to be weak. To treat his injury and reduce his pain, Bruce Lee used a Corazon steroid daughter. Thanks to Corizon and physiotherapy sessions, Bruce Lee, contrary to what the data had predicted, he resumed training. Bruce Lee was a dreamer. He repeated, I want to go to Hollywood. I want to be a star and he was determined to achieve his dreams. He wanted to achieve excellence in the martial arts and this in the cinema. So every day he kept his goal in mind with the solemn of releasing his dream. From 3 to 23 years old, Bruce Lee walked tireless then at 24 he was following the martial arts tournament in the United States and was invited to pass off the test. Now, uh, show us some Kung Fu movement. Well, it is hard to show it alone, but uh, I will try to do my best. Alright, maybe one of the fellows will walk in. Walk yeah, it would be... Uh, Go ahead. ahead. Alright. There is the finger jab. There is the punch, there is the back fist, and then low. Of course, then they use legs, straight at the ground, all come up. Or, if I can back up a little bit, they start that something, and then come back. <laughs> all right. It, it kind of works. His mastery of martial arts and his charisma on green allowed him to bring the role of Kirtin in the film The Green Honor. But Bruce his career is not taking off. So it was a big failure for him. Bruce trained tirelessly. He was tireless. He walked around the clock. He trained in heaven in his sleep. He had an unfailing determination. He let no obstacle stand in his way. Inside this impromising body, he developed a will to succeed that nothing could stop him, which was going to make him the Bruce that everyone knows today. In 1971, when Bruce Lee's career began to fall in the United States, Bruce returned to Hong Kong where he shot in a small body and production for $7,500 per film. The film was a fixed boxing art in the new of the daily recess. Bruce Lee was offered the lead role in Operation Dragon, a Hollywood film, which will make Bruce Lee a real star. He's only 32 years old, Bruce has achieved great success in the world. At 2.30 p.m. on May 10th, 1973, Bruce collapsed with honest timing post for Operation Dragon. He appeared to be having an epileptic fit and he lay tense on the shaking ground for several minutes. And then he was rushed to a new hospital and daughter had struggled to sit out him and daughter had menaced him and an hour later Bruce regained consciousness. And on May 27th, 1973, Bruce traveled to California to try to determine what caused him to collapse. So on July 20th, 1973, 7 p.m. in Hong Kong, Bruce and his business partner at his girlfriend, Betty, is housed to pursue their plans for the movie Game of Death. As he was talking, Bruce realizes that he was not feeling well and he had a headache. 
Soberi gave him prescription painkiller. Despite taking the medicine, the pain increases and this caused to lie down, try to calm down a bit. After an hour, Berry comes back to try to wake up Bruce Lee, but without success. She leaves and comes back again, one age further later, to try to wake him up and again without success. Instead of going with Bruce to the hospital, but Betty calling people because she was afraid of scandal that must happen at his house. Then after several minutes, he called his daughter. For the second time in two months, Bruce is rushed to hospital. At 10.15 p.m., Bruce is admitted in emergency. The doctors try the impossible to resuscitate him, but without success. At 11.30 p.m., Bruce Lee is pronounced dead. The real Bruce who made success with these four films which are The Fury of the Feeling in 1972 The Fury of the Dragon in 1972 Operation Dragon in 1973 as well as the game of death which left in progress. And this Bruce died on July 20th, 1973, 11.30 p.m. in Hong Kong. He was buried four days later in the hometown of his wife, Linda Emery. The official cause of his death is celebrated at Dimoko by a painkiller which raises enormous doubts in many daughters. So tell us in the comments if you want to know the real secret of the famous Bruce Lee's and time leaders. And don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you like Bruce Lee. Thanks for the next video.